And what's unique about a torque converter is that it multiplies torque, nearly doubling the engine's torque to launch the vehicle. At ignition, as the engine flywheel rotates and the converter pump rotates with it, pressurized fluid is drawn from the sump into the converter cavity. Centrifugal force causes the fluid to be thrown out from the pump onto the veins of the converter turbine. As the fluid comes back off the bottom of the turbine blades, it strikes the front face of the stator blades. As the stator is designed not to rotate in that direction, it redirects the fluid back towards the pump at an accelerated rate. And as this cycle is repeated, the fluid gains an extra push and the rotational force is multiplied enabling the turbine to transfer up to twice the full engine torque to the drivetrain. This is the vortex flow phase. As the turbine increases speed and approaches the speed of the pump, the converter reaches its maximum efficiency. At this point, the electronic controls activate the lockup clutch that instantly connects the turbine and pump, creating an efficient, direct mechanical connection between engine and drivetrain.